Next up, this is kind of interesting. Almost a year ago today, Gary Gensler claimed that there would be a crackdown coming on market manipulation. Has he done it yet, though? No. Hedge funds are literally leeching billions a day while he watches. And this is in regards to the article from October 8th, which is almost a year ago now. It says, SEC chief to Wall Street. The everything crackdown is coming. From crypto to meme stocks, Gensler pledges to tackle it all. A full agenda has allies critics question, can he do it? So, oddly enough, the SEC, I will say, I'm not trying to defend the SEC or Gary Gensler, because in my opinion, I don't think that they had done a lot, if not anything, over the last year. But I will say, in their defense, it seems like as of recently, or like literally the last week or so, there have been more reports coming out that they have been cracking down on some new firms, and it seems like they're actively trying to at least portray that they're working harder than they have been, I guess. So, trying to remain optimistic that there will be some changes to the markets, but so far, it's really been disappointing. Comment down below if you agree with this, guys. The SEC Ethics Office voted most useless office in America for the second year in a row. So there's new articles coming out now for mainstream media even saying that the SEC is pretty hated. And a lot of people are saying that they're absolutely useless. Comment down below some things that you want to see the SEC do, enact, or change in this up and coming year. Apes, hold no matter what happens. If they halt the stock every five minutes, hold. If it goes up and drops hard, hold. No matter what happens, apes, hold. We will win. We will be filthy rich if the apes hold. So for the majority of us apes that have been holding on to the shares, you know, for a year, year plus that, you know, we're truly investors. We're not day traders. In my opinion, I feel like the holds don't really make too much of a difference. When I see AMC rise up 20%, 30% and it's halted and drops down 5%, 10%, it doesn't make a difference. I'm not selling my shares either way. The only thing that's affected during those halts are probably the day traders, which are going to be shaked out after some time, no matter what. So for the real investors, for the real holders, the halts, the drops, the rips, they don't really matter until the bigger picture is fulfilled.